outdoors, bucks and bass and beers. 3B Outdoors premier sponsors are Spot Hog, makers of serious archery products, and W.E. McConnell and Sons, high performance builders of high performance nationwide homes. Welcome to another week here at 3B Outdoors. We've got some great hunts coming up for you on this week's show. On this first hunt, we're going with a young lady named Kendra McDavid. She's going to be in Southwest Virginia doing a little quality management. And the thing that makes this special, she's got her dad running the camera for her. After that, it's back to Tennessee with Coates and I in a blind with a bow chasing another one of those old Tennessee longbeards. And on the last hunt, we're going with a young man named Colby Grimes. He's going to the Bluegrass State after some big whitetail. And he also has his dad running a camera. I can't wait to show you what he gets to lay his hands on. Thanks for being with us. I'm Freddie Neely, and welcome to 3B Outdoors. Hey guys, it's November 23rd here in Southwest Virginia, which means that it is opening day of Doe Week. I had to miss it this morning because I had to work, but you know, we're out here with my baby, my 25 out 6, and we're going to do our part in some doe management today. Not saying if a buck walks out, I'm not going to kill it, but really we're going for some nannies today. This is a beautiful place, so at least no matter what, we're going to get to see some beautiful scenery but i'm hoping to uh manage some does today stick with us Well guys, here she is. Big, mature Southwest Virginia doe. Feels really good to finally be able to connect something on camera. Um, we waited around to see if we could get a double with dad, but that didn't happen and we ended up letting it get cold. It is absolutely freezing now. Um, so we're gonna get her cleaned up, get to the house and try to thaw out. Thanks for watching. Guys, it's Thanksgiving morning here in Southwest Virginia, and as you can see, it is a white Thanksgiving. And I'll tell you what, it is cold. We're hunting here on our good friend's farm, and in return for us getting to hunt here, he wants us to kill those. He's overrun, and they make a mess out of everything. So, since it's Doe Week and it's Thanksgiving Day, we're gonna give him some. So the first one that walks out, mature doe. We're gonna take her. There's turkeys all around us too, so maybe we'll have a good fresh turkey for Thanksgiving. Stick around and see what we can do. You want the front one?
惯。Guys, we had a slight change in plans, <laughs> as what usually happens when we and Dad are hunting together. Um, after I killed mine, it was really early, so we still had plenty of time. So we just sat around, and we attempted to make it a double. Should have been a double, but Daddy missed his. <laughs> and I hate to do that to him, but, you know, hey, he ought to learn from me. But anyways, now we're just going to go and get mine. And let you see her come with us well here she is guys it's awfully nice when you don't have to track them very far big nice southwest virginia doe got her done early now we can go home eat some breakfast before thanksgiving dinner tell them what you did hen oh we was gonna pull a double today but he had missed his and uh with the big old gun 100 yards i ain't figured out yet how i done that this old age thing must be getting really hard. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Hey, we still hear turkeys down here. Turkey day is in. Guess what? I'm going to fight you for the gun. Mm. <laughs> I'm going to let you have it. Sounds like a good deal. Well, let's get her taken care of and get home. Let's do that and get some Thanksgiving dinner in. All right. You had a good day. You did we good, have. sis. This portion of 3B Outdoors brought to you by Nelson's Outfitters, Trophy Hunts in Wyoming and Montana, Sunline, Tenzing Packs and Gear, Watson's Airlock, Kistler Rods, Under Armour, Big Dog Muzzleloaders, Fray Bill, Preferred Insurance Solutions, Bass Pro Shops, and Express Signs, specializing in lighting signs, vinyl graphics, and making 3B Outdoors look good. I saw Brent going hunting again this morning. I thought he was building a new home. Haven't you heard? It's already built. McConnell and Son took care of everything, completely hassle-free. You know, Fess, Brent and I, we've thought about building a new home, but we're afraid it'll end up in divorce. Nah, I think you guys will do great. Just let Andy McConnell handle all the worries. I've heard him say it many a times. He aims to save marriages. W. McConnell and Sons, give him a call. Hunting. Fishing. It's time we settle this. Okay, let's go to Wally's. Let's go! Nathan. Wally's has everything a hunter needs. Freddie, have you seen all the fishing tackle at Wally's? I said hunting. And I said fishing. Hey guys, you're both right. I'm Andrew, owner of Wally's Sporting Goods, a haven for all sportsmen and women. From rifles to rods and reels, Wally's Sporting Goods is your locally owned outdoor connection. Hunting and fishing. ATC Cooling and Heating, your factory authorized carrier dealer. Turn to the experts specializing in geothermal heat pump systems. Take advantage of a 30% tax credit for geothermal installation and rebates up to $1,750. Winter, spring, summer, or fall, all you have to do is call the folks at ATC Cooling and Heating. When all other brands fall, carrier and ATC stand tall. Your geothermal heat pump specialist. Stay tuned for more of the greatest hunting show that's ever been on earth, 3B Outdoors. You know, we're hunting in Tennessee a few weeks into the season and me and Dee goes back to one of our favorite spots. We slip up into this area and we get there a little bit after daylight because they're calling for a lot of rain this day. And it rains a while and the sun comes out a while. So, you know, we didn't have a whole lot of other choices just to stick it out. So we stuck it out. We called a little, listened a little, called a little, and the next thing you know, we, we heard a gobble. And we started calling a little bit, and before you know it, this bird was right in our lap. Big D's with me this morning. He's done killed two, so I'm a little behind. Got the old Matthews bow. And uh, like I said, we heard a little bit of gobbling. We've been doing a little turkey talk with the uh, Turkey man, Eddie Salter, down and dirty, turkey cow. It's um, first of April, and uh, hopefully we're in a primo spline. We've got some decoys out on this big flat, and uh, hopefully we can get something in here this morning. So 
Stay with us. We'll figure something out. Easy. I ain't seen a copper yet. Here he comes, here he comes. Two of Well, folks, right here's the end result. It's uh, kind of turned out to be a 
pretty nice day. It was real foggy this morning and uh, had Big D in the blind with me. We was trying to kill, we was trying to do a double. So we let my bird uh, go and thought I made a good hit on him and went over the hill. And uh, we sat there for about three, four more hours calling and trying to get another bird in. And we finally looked, go try to find this bird. Find out we had to chase him, climb down the ridge. So uh, sorry you didn't get to see all that footage, but uh, this is the end result. Thank the good Lord. And uh, man, it's been a good day. This segment of 3B Outdoors presented by Matthews. Catch us if you can. Plano, Rage Broadheads, Motormate USA, Canon Sunglasses, Hunter Safety Systems, Lawrence HDS Gen 2 Touch, Hardcore, Waterfowl Decoys and Gear, Luminoc, and Paul Clark State Farm Insurance, 3B Outdoors Preferred Insurance Provider. Hi, I'm Eddie McConnell, owner of W.E. McConnell & Son. We are a franchise builder of Nationwide Homes. We have over 35 years of experience building, over 100 house plans to choose from, or we can customize your home plan to make your dream come true. We're not only better at building homes, we're better at building homes better. Did you build my house? I built your house. You built the best house ever. It's <laughs> good. At Ravy Ford, we're having the big deal sale. This is a big deal. Every new 2013 Ford and Lincoln will have the factory invoice posted in the window. Now that is a big deal. And we have 0% financing and no payments for 90 days on most vehicles. Do I need to say it again? Hmm, yes, that is a big deal. At Ramey Ford, we do the deal. Now that's a big deal. Hey, I'm Freddie Neely from 3B Outdoors. For the last seven years, I've shot a spot hog sight. It's the most durable, dependable, rugged sight that I've ever come in contact with. After several states and several critters later, I'm still greedy. So if you want to get greedy, go give Josh Johnson from Spot Hog a call. Tell him 3B Outdoor Boys sent you. Or better yet, go to spothog.com and order all their products. There they are. There they are. How come something spooked them? Was that a burn ground? No, it was my stomach. I'm hungry. Well, this turkey hunting's way overrated. Let's go down Kearney's and get us some of that roasted chicken they talk about. You know what Mike says? Seven days without chicken makes one week. Let's go. Hey, let's go. I'm all for that. You want a good home cooked meal? Come to Lynn Garden Restaurant in Kingsport. You won't be disappointed. And here's the proof. Shot. Ah, I don't fear anything daddy's ever killed. Just leave him alone, put the safety back on. Uh, 
Oh, you can back up. You can... He's down. He's down. Knuckles, baby. Knuckles, knuckles, go! I love you, son. Golly, I love you. I hope it was on video for all to see. Kentucky, our first morning in Kentucky, and Colby just put a brute on the ground. Colby just put a brute on the ground. Thank you, dear Jesus. Colby, what do you say? Thank you. Thank you, good Lord. Thank you. All right, buddy. You've waited a long time for this. He's down over there. Mm -hmm. Be easy. Let's go down and get your deer, okay? Okay. Be easy. Two trees, they're over there. You should see the leaves where they there's some big blood in here. Where? Up there. See the blood right here? Well, if you need to follow the blood trail, you know how to do that. Yep. Kobe on his first buck ever here in Kentucky. And he's a big one. He's on the blood trail. Stay with us. You see him yet? Yeah, Where, where's he at? Look at the horns laying on the ground, boys. Good job, son. Boy, he's a giant, Colby. That may be a 10 pointer. There you go. There you go. Golly, what a house. What a house, son. Son, that's awesome. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven points. Yeah. Look here, buddy. Give me some dad. Five, boy. It's bigger than your dad. Anything your daddy's ever killed. Here we are, November twentieth, in Greenup County, Kentucky. We're just right down the road from where we've seen Richie and Bucky and Freddie and Pete take some big deer. Uh, this will be an eleven pointer. And my son Colby's here with me. Twelve years old. Just put the smack down on this big thing about 7.30 this morning. First deer we saw. Uh, I, we were sitting there in the tree and I was getting a little worried. We didn't come in and put up our tree stands till yesterday about lunchtime. And we decided to hunt somewhere else yesterday afternoon. We didn't see a deer. And then this morning, you know, I've hunted here before and seen deer all day. And I was getting a little worried and I heard this thing coming. And I seen him and I tried to get the camera on there. Hopefully we did. I told Colby, here he comes, but he went out of sight. And uh, went down over a thicket. I could see him just, I could see the horns going through the thicket. It's real thick. And uh, I had told Colby, I said, I'm going to hit this little can call, the Primos Doe and Heat call. I hit that call, and this thing turned right around and it came right to us within 20 yards. Uh, I hope I got it on video. It, uh, I was on one side of the tree and Colby was on the other, and I, I just, I was more worried about him getting a shot, this being a big deer, than I was about getting on camera, just to tell you the truth. I wasn't going to. I wasn't gonna mess it up for him. 20 yards, he shot. Thing fell right in his tracks, got up and ran about 20 more and he was done. And we, we screamed out and we thanked the good Lord that, that he gave us the opportunity to do this. Uh, uh, I love this little boy and I'm so proud of him. I, I can't stand it. I, if I wouldn't have been strapped into the tree, I probably would have fell out. I was shaking, I was calling Bucky. I, I, I couldn't talk, uh, sending people text messages. I just, I couldn't believe it. But anyways, here we are. We got one more deer to go. And 
it's going to have to be a doe. We I don't think we can outdo this one on this trip, but you don't ever know. But we got a doe tag left, and we'll see what we can do with that. Keep watching, and Colby, what do you think about your deer? Pretty big. It's a big deer, isn't it? Yep. Hey, I'm proud of you, son. Yeah. I love you. Love you too. All right. Y'all keep watching. We bring it to you just like it happens. Wow, I hope you guys enjoyed that show as much as I did. How about Kendra McDavid doing a little quality management in Southwest Virginia and her dad behind the camera? You know, there's not too many young ladies out there that goes at it any harder than Kendra does. Then Dustin Coates and I back in Tennessee, back in a blind with a bow. You know, it don't get much better than that. I never get tired of that. Then we're going to Kentucky with Kobe Grimes killing that big old Kentucky Wally Bopper. You know, I don't know who was more excited, Kobe or his dad Aaron. And you know, it's always special having your dad with you and he was behind the camera. Congratulations, Kobe, on a big old Kentucky whitetail. You know, we're about out of time again this week, folks. Join us again next week where we'll have you somewhere in the woods or on the water. I'm Freddie Neely, and thanks so much for watching 3B Outdoors Television. We wake up in the morning before the rising sun. Load up boats, rising rigs.